Non-invasive ventilation, or NIV, is a treatment that we use to treat respiratory failure and breathlessness. NIV isn't always comfortable, and when you're suddenly very unwell, it can be quite scary. But when we get it right, NIV can really help to relieve the symptoms of breathlessness, and it's very successful at making you feel better. We have made this video with the help of our patients to try and help you to understand what it might be like if you or someone you know ever has to have acute NIV treatment. You don't hear a lot about it. I knew, I knew nothing, absolutely nothing at all about it until it was explained to me. Knowledge is power. Every time, knowledge is power. And if, if the patient can be aware that, be prepared for something over your face, which you probably more than likely will be terribly frightened of. However, be prepared to know that it can help you. I was able to breathe more comfortable and to be, well, to be alive today. Respiratory failure can be extremely dangerous. It can make you breathless or even unconscious. The respiratory system and the lungs are responsible for getting the oxygen into your body and the body's waste gas, carbon dioxide, out of your body. In respiratory failure, the levels of these gases become abnormal, the oxygen is too low and the carbon dioxide becomes dangerously high. NIV helps to support your breathing and to get these gases back to normal. In order to do this, we have to fit a tight-fitting mask to your face and the NIV machine will apply pressures through that mask to help blow the air in and out of your lungs. There are lots of different sizes and shapes of mask and we try to find the one that suits the shape of your face best. Your doctors and nurses will help you to choose the mask that fits best to your face, but we do know that it still can be uncomfortable. Now, it's up to you whether you can take having something over your face, because it's quite, it's psychological actually. I thought I'd be claustrophobic with it on my face, but I wasn't. Oh, I would definitely recommend it. I definitely recommend the machines. The, the benefit is, uh, I mean, it's ten times better. Anyway, when my grandson thinks I'm cool, he thinks I'm Darth Vader, I think. After we've found the right mask for you, it does take some time for your gases to come back to normal. Whilst you're on the machine, we monitor you very carefully during this time and we will change the settings of the machine in response to the results from your blood gases. Throughout this period, we try and make it as comfortable for you as possible. Whilst you're on the machine, it should make you feel less breathless, it should help your breathing, but it can take some time to get used to. But if you relax, you should be able to feel more comfortable and less breathless. While you're on NIV, you will be looked after in certain areas of the hospital. These areas can be quite busy and quite noisy. They have lots of different alarms and lots of different people. While you're on NIV, you will be monitored very closely. You'll have a probe on your finger monitoring your oxygen levels. You'll have a monitor monitoring your heart rate and we will take your blood pressure regularly. There will be a team of doctors, nurses and physiotherapists to look after you. There will always be a nurse around. They will show you how to take the mask off and how to call them with the call bell. They will be available to make you feel as comfortable as possible and to answer any questions that you might have. Going on is amazing. I know that I'm going to be, it's like a wee tune. It puts me sleep. I can. I like my audible books, so I'll have a book to listen to. And just go that. Go with it, rather than fight it. If you fight it, you're not getting anywhere, and you're gonna need it anyway. And you're not gonna get any better if you don't use it. So it's best to just take it easy and let yourself go. To monitor the gases in your blood, we need to take arterial blood. The blood test is done in your wrist, and we do what we can to minimise the number of blood tests that we need to do. Your doctors, if you're going to be on NIV for a prolonged period of time, may put something called an arterial line into your wrist, and this helps reduce the number of times they have to take separate blood tests. For the first 24 hours of treatment, you'll be on the mask pretty continuously. You will be able to have breaks to go to the bathroom, to have cups of tea and to have your chest physiotherapy and take your medication. Over the second and third day, we will slowly bring down the number of hours that you have to have the mask and eventually we'll just be giving it to you overnight. Some people do need to go home with NIV, in which case we will set that up for you while you're in hospital. I was using it all through the night and I was asleep and that was very good. And I woke up with it and after a certain amount of time, it felt that as if I, it wasn't there. I was just breathing on my own. 
you can tell yourself and you can tell your, you know, the patient that you know what, this is actually good for you. So let's get through the uncomfortableness of it, of the actual apparatus and uh, let it do its thing. NIV can be a life-saving treatment, but we know that it is uncomfortable and it can be difficult to tolerate. We aim to make sure that our patients all have control over their treatment and we know that you might not want to have NIV at all or to see somebody you know or love being treated with NIV. Your doctors and nursing team will discuss all the options with you and help you to make the right decision for you. There's lots that we can do to make the treatment more tolerable and help you to get better. Try it. Definitely you must try it to, to experience it, I think. You must try to experience it for the better for your health. For someone who's never used it, and if they think that it's something that can help them, I would never stop them. I would never say, no, don't do it. It did bring me back from the brink of death. I would definitely say do it. Uh, if you want to improve how you feel and your, your health, I mean, I've seen with my own eyes the improvement over hours uh, and then days, do you know what I mean? So I would definitely say do it. Just go with it, go with it and you will. And you'll be, it'll be the, good, the best thing you've ever done. But you'll have to go with it. I, I think it's just like being a spaceman, really. You, know? <laughs> you, you, you just try something else that's not been tried before. And uh, it's just an adventure, really. Thank you.